Tetris. I'm happy you came to find me. Allow me to apologize once again. I should have spoken to you sooner, told you what I knew, and not betrayed your trust. Indeed you should have. As I said, I'd like to make up for it and help you find your family. Ooh. Again. How do you intend to do that? As you now know, I knew your mother. We had trouble communicating at first, of course, but we gradually learned to understand one another. She was important in her village, based on what I know today. I think she was a Danae. Cool. She told me her name, Arelwyn, and told me about her family. She even gave me a pendant for you. You were only a oh, child, so I gave it to Mrs. Desada. That for pendant. She gave me a necklace when I went to say goodbye to her. She said it was a family heirloom. Did my mother tell you the name of her village? No. But I'm sure the Nords can help us. They were the ones who took your mother to the continent. It was such a long time ago. How can I find out if they remember? The Nords record everything down to the gentlest breeze. They must have written something in a logbook somewhere. So, do you want to try and find out where you come from? Do you want to find your relatives? Yeah, of course. Yes, I do. Yes. All this is so new to me, but I suppose so, yes. Let's go then. Cool. Yeah, um... Confirm. Since we're going to the knots, I'm just gonna switch things up. Um... Where's my sweetheart? There you are, Vasco. Uh... Add Vasco in, just for the time being. I probably will... Will end up... Oh wait, Vasco. My Tempest. Can I do anything for you? I'm asleep. I just want you in my in my party, but dude. My temp. Can I do? Oh wait, he already is in my party. You. Okay. The other thing is, Vasco, do you need a change of armor? I'm not sure if you do. Um, no. So that navigator's coat can go away. But I might need it just for, just use it as a costume at some point. So, maybe I'll keep it around. But I do, okay, where am I going? Ask Admiral, okay. And that is, okay, um. I have to travel to get there. Okay. Can't I just travel from my residence? Alright, I guess I will just go all the way over there. Ask Admiral Cabral. Catch up with Egon, find the dispensary. We'll get to Egon in due time. I want to help my friend Petrus. I also need to sell some stuff because I feel like my inventory is getting pretty weighty. So. Right this way. Anything for you? Anything for you? What can I do for you? It's not. All right, nothing new. Let's go, Petrus. Let's go seek out my family. Beautiful. Yes, yes, yes. Um, new Serene. Yeah, why not? Uh, we need to sell some stuff. Yep, 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 yep. Sale. 
Uh, we don't need this. Uh, I'll keep that around just for costumes. Don't need that. Priests don't need that. I need this. I need... Uh, don't need that. Old damaged gauntlets. I don't know if I need a damaged gauntlet. Soft old boots. Nope. Nope and nope. Okay. Lots of nope. Oop, didn't mean to pull out my, my, uh, my, uh, casting arm there, sir. Sorry. You could think that I was, like, trying to steal something. Hey, you. You have come at the right time, Your Excellency. You need me to do something. I am in a delicate situation oh, and your help oh, Of course you are. I'm listening, Admiral. Captain Reuben warned me that he suspected a member of his crew of being a spy. It is almost certain she sent secret navigation information to foreigners. Why ask me to take care of it? This is a very serious accusation. One that results in a member of the guild being expelled. The Norts are like a family, very connected, but also likely to carry resentment. I think an external view is required to be certain that there will be no bias. Anyway, their ship is anchored at New Serene. Your authority will allow you to get more answers than us. I see. What is the exact nature of the information that could have been sent? It's up to you to find out. But all the Noughts know how we navigate our ships. You've seen the techniques we use, and you know we want to keep them secret. I agree. Where can I find Captain Reuben? At the port in your town. You know his ship. It was Captain Vasco's before he oh, landed. Oh, perfect. I'm counting on you, Your Excellency. We must shed light on this case. I'm shocked that Vasco didn't chime in at all. I have come to talk to you about a personal matter. After what I revealed to you, I was sure you would come back to find me. What would you like to know? You told me that I was born on one of your ships. Of an islander captured on the island. We'd like to know about this woman's origins. I'm afraid I can't help you. I did not take part in those expeditions. And our old archives are far from here. Is there no one on Tia Fredi who can help us? Please. Very well. I do know an old captain who could perhaps help you out. Where can he be found? His ship is moored in the port of Hickman, Hickman if eh? I'm not mistaken. His name is Captain Lissandro. Thank you for your help, Admiral. De Sarde? Yes, Admiral. Don't get too caught up in the past. That one in particular. Nothing good will come Nothing of it. Nothing good? Whether or not we choose to get caught up in it, Admiral, the past always catches up with us. Sadly, I'm paying the price of this. I don't know if I agree that nothing good will come out of it. I think closure would be great. You know, closure's nice. Did you ever think of that, Captain? All right, so let's go and, while we're here, go back to Vasco's ex-ship. The ex. Hey, Liu Kang. What brings you here? Uh, it doesn't... The Admiral asked me to shed light on your little problem of indiscretion in your ranks. I see. I would be happy to answer any questions you have. You told the Admiral that you suspect one of your crew members. Indeed. The young apprentice sailor, Alba. A committed volunteer from Telemi. Uh, she only joined us a short time ago. Hmm. Did you want to know anything else? The Admiral told me that you were the new captain of the ship we arrived on. The Seahorse? Yes. It's an excellent ship and a good crew. But you did the crossing. You know it as well as me. Did you want to know anything I else? I guess I exhausted everything. That'll be all, Captain. Thank you. So... I talked to Captain Reuben. What brings you here? The Admiral asked me to share. I see. What led you to these suspicions? Well, the girl's behavior. She was very eager at first, very willing, almost too much. Then, suddenly, she became nervous. She isolated herself and did not speak to others. She's a recent recruit, which inevitably raised some doubts about her vocation. Sometimes I saw her hanging around my cabin. My papers were often disturbed. And since we've returned to port, She's almost never on board. Well, you can understand my concern, mm. but you should probably talk to the other members of the crew. They may know something else. Ultimately, 
Your strong suspicion stems from the fact that she's sea given. Hmm. A recent sea given. She did not join us as a child. But you know how rare volunteers are. Especially from Talaymi. Did you want to know anything else? I guess not. Um. Do you know what information she may have sent? I don't know exactly what you know about our navigation methods. Let's say that magic does not have much to do with it. I see. Well, of course she knows that too. She saw some of our machines on board. And by searching through my papers, she could get even more sensitive information. Okay. Did you want to know anything else? The Admiral told me that you were the new captain of the ship we arrived on. The Seahorse? Yes. It's an excellent ship and a good crew. But you did the crossing. You know it as well as me. Did you want to know anything else? All right. That'll be all, Captain. Thank you. All right. So now, question the Captain's crew. All right. Wow. They're all over here. Um, yo. Your Excellency. I am so pleased to see you again. The pleasure is shared. Captain. Good day, Jonas. Oh, yeah, it's Jonas. What can I do for I remember you? Jonas. Yeah. Yeah, what's up, buddy? I would like you to tell me anything you can about a member of your crew. Alba. She joined our party recently. But I like her already. She works hard and is full of courage. You know, she is one of those rare knots that joined of her own volition. And she did everything she could to become one of our own. Until we arrived here. She suddenly became distraught and frightened. They brought back memories. Do you know where I could find her? I'd like to ask her some questions. N no. I've not seen her for a while. Maybe at the tavern? She was playing cards there from time to time. Anything else, Your Excellency? Um... Oh yeah, cool. I want to catch up with Jonas. How have things been since you made it back? Very good. Everyone's been looking out for me extra careful. Of. I hope so. I do miss my parents from time to time. But I don't miss the warehouse or the mercenaries. My real family is on the waves. Thanks for helping me to return to them. Anything else, Your Excellency? You're welcome. What have you been up to since we made it to Tier 4 D? I'm still just a cabin boy. But I have high hopes to be promoted to seaman for our next crossing. Since our captain changed, we've been doing nothing but coasting and small trade. But that won't last. Anything else, Your Excellency? Good luck in that promotion. I'm glad to see that you're ambitious. I'm afraid I need to be going. Watch out for yourself. All right. Lavia again. Captain, delighted to see you again. We've missed Thank you. Thank you. Your Excellency, it's a pleasure. What can I do for you? We have a few questions to ask you, Flavio. I'm all yours, Captain. Can you tell me anything about Alba? Oh, I don't know her very well. She only joined our crew recently. But she pulls her away. You can't hold that against her. You might say she shows a little too much zeal even at times. Mm -hmm. That being said, ever since we got here, I found her a little distraught. You could even say nervous. Would you know where I could find her? No. I wouldn't. Where's she missed roll call? Well, I hope she didn't do something stupid. These committed volunteers, we never know if we can trust them. Anything else? Um... What have you been up to since we landed? Nothing worthy of writing home about. Just shuffling merchandise around the aisle from port to port. I prefer the high sea. Anything else? Oh, okay. Um, is it, does she identify as a boy? Does this, does she, is, wait, does, do they identify themselves as a, as a him? That is interesting. Are you happy on Tear More than on the continent, that's certain. But being on solid ground always makes me feel a little too anchored. Especially after what happened to Jonas. The island is beautiful, the natives rather friendly, but all said and done, it's off the coast where I truly feel at home. Anything else? Alright, thank you. I need to be off. Perhaps we'll meet later. Farewell then. Yeah, cool to catch up with you guys, since the prologue of the game. Hey, 
Happy to see you again. How have things been going for you since your crossing? Good, thank you. Even if I've got quite a list of errands to check off. Then straight to it. What can I do for you? I'm looking for a nought. A young woman going by the name of Alba. I know her. She joined our crew at the same time as our new captain. Did you try the tavern? Don't give me that look there. I've kept from the bottle since that story with Jonas, you know that. No matter. When we're at dock, there's nothing much else to do. It might be that little Alba went there to take a look. Anything else? How have things been going for you since we landed? Well, it came as quite a shock to see you grounded, Captain. We truly wondered why. Mm. Alas, the Admiral's decisions are as mysterious as those of the luminous Laura. Impenetrable. That's true. But the crossing went so well, didn't it? And since Captain Rubin took the helm for you, well, he's not the talkative type. But then I'm not going to complain. We've been sailing the small rounds of late, keeping busy. We go from port to port around the island. It's peaceful. At least we're in port often. Anything else? Mm. Ask her about. Oh, and this person apparently identifies as a woman. Oh, okay. Do you like it on Tefridi? It's not as nice as our isle, but it's far better than the continent. Here at least we can breathe without smelling a corpse round every corner. And the coast is beautiful. And you know, the taverns aren't so bad. Anything else? Okay, well thanks. I need to go. Farewell. Smooth sailing. Naturally, she's at the tavern. I'm afraid these little secrets have not helped us a great deal. This Alba had just enlisted. She was happy, then changed her attitude. But is she a spy? We were told that she was sometimes at the tavern. We should take a look there. Yeah. There's the Sarde repeating our quest items. All right. It's almost like this we're nearing time. the end game. You are going well, if these far. drunkards have one of their rounds, we'll end up in a fight. That's it. You can shout all you want, but I'm right, you old drunkard. Not at all. Come on, gentlemen. Please calm down. Who are you to give us orders? That's true. You want to see how tough? Oh. You don't know who you're uh, messing with. I don't think with. you know who you're messing with. My child, I doubt that your job as legate involves managing fights between drunkards. Um, yeah, but I'm gonna do it anyway. You better get out of here unless you want to end up in jail. Oh, he thinks we'll allow that oh, to happen. Okay. On God, sir! <sighs> right. On God! You poor drunkard. <laughs> You poor, poor drunkards. I'm sorry. Maybe. Don't take me in this battle. But it's on my Let me see here. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. Um. Who doesn't know who they're dealing with? Uh. You're not the one who's OP, guys. Wrong decision. Wrong decision. Okay. Investigate the tavern. All the way over there? Lower floor. Boys, boys, boys. Come on. Outside? This is the tavern, though. Yeah, this is the tavern. Maybe I just need to talk to everyone.
Hello, my darlings. It's rare to see the upper crust in here. It must be my lucky the day. The upper crust. Do you and yours want to have a good time? I could call a few friends. Nah, it's okay. I'm sorry, but I'm not here for that. Really? What would you like, then? No. I'll let you get on. <sighs> what a shame. Come back soon. Yeah, sorry, I'm not into girls. Sorry. Speak to worker. Maybe I'll talk to the innkeeper. What can I pull for you? Evoke the subject of Alba. I'm looking for a young nought. She goes by the name of Alba and sails on Captain Ruben's ship. I wouldn't know who that is. Why don't you go and ask that fellow over there? He often shares a bottle with the sailors. He might remember your nought. What nought. fellow? Anything what else? What fellow? I didn't see the fellow. Nothing, thanks. I'm not thirsty just yet. Which fellow? This fellow? Not what? Which fellow? Oh, that fellow. Hey, look at that! <laughs> the upper crust coming to slum it at the tavern. What is it with you guys in bread? How may I help you? What is it with you guys in bread? Um, I'm wondering if Alba's last name is Jessica. We're looking for a young nought. She's part of Captain Ruben's crew. Yeah, I think I know what you're talking about. A girl who loses her pay with style. <laughs> but I don't know where she is. She looked sad last time I saw her. Didn't have her head in the game. Uh, all right, well, where did she go? Have you ever heard her talk about secrets or documents she would like to exchange? Are you asking me if she's a spy? <laughs> no idea she told me nothing. But if that's why you're looking for her... I may have seen things that might interest you. I'm often mistaken for a drunkard, so they pay no attention to me. But I see everything. Mm hmm. What did you see, sir? Tell me what you saw. I'd like to tell you all that, but... <coughs> my throat's a little dry, my friend. This should quench your thirst. So, what did you see? Well, mm. returning late at night, I spotted a guy I'd seen before at the tavern. He often spent time with the Nort, and he was in the street, fiddling with a stone, looking suspicious. So, I took a closer look when he left. I thought he'd stashed money or something, but no. There was a box under the stone, mm. but there was no gold inside, just papers. Okay. They were messages, and from the look of the guy, they couldn't be love letters. <laughs> Now, I don't know how to read, so I couldn't understand what it was about, but maybe those were your secrets? Where is this hiding place? Cross the bridge at the exit of the town. On the left, look for the stone. The box is underneath. Thank you, soldier. My pleasure, friend. Huh. Do you want to know anything Mind else? Find a dead drop. That's okay. That'll be all, soldier. Thank you. Alright, I don't remember what he just said, but hopefully the game did. Um, aha. Uh -huh. Thank you, map. What a magical map. Alright. Alright. Let's see what we can unearth over here. That what he said about the dead drop. Oh, examine here. This stone must be the one the soldier told us about. Look, it hides a box. It's a dead drop. It's suspicious, but it doesn't reveal any secrets or who uses it. Well then, we'll have to catch whoever uses it red-handed. Oh, I'm a little old for hiding in the bushes, but if that's what you want to do... Um, okay, catch the person. Better not touch it. 
Nobody should know that we discovered this box. So should I just... Alright, so I'm just gonna make my way up there. Or not. Alright, up this way. Perfect. We have a great view of the box from here. Shall we wait How here? How long are we gonna wait for? Wait until nightfall. Alright. That's it. Suspect in sight. He's only a messenger. We should follow him. Okay. But try not to get him. Alright. Just gonna keep my distance so I can keep a side of him. Who gave the order? Hello. Well, gentlemen, what are you plotting? Fool! They followed us! I thought I was careful. I'm the legate of the merchant congregation, and you have been caught plotting treason. So I suggest you talk. What do these messages contain, and what are they about? You're wasting your time. I, I, I won't say a word. Attempt to intimidate him. Do you realize that you were suspected of espionage and conspiracy? Don't you think you better explain yourself? Wait, I, I don't want to end up in jail. It it's not about the secrets of the congregation. Uh, let me explain. Some time ago, it was rumored that the secrets of the Norts were for sale. My country was interested. So I started exchanging messages as you've been doing. The Nort who was willing to give up these secrets demanded a fortune. He also wanted to become a citizen. But we were only at the negotiation stage. For the moment, uh, I have received nothing concrete. Just promises. Who is the Nort you're talking to? Oh, I've no idea. The messages were signed White Rose. Hmm. But I doubt it's a real name. Very well. Like Candy Cane. You seem to be telling the truth. Alba means white, Desardé. But it's a little unsubstantial. And give me the message in your possession before leaving. Very well. Here it is. Now, if you'll allow me, uh, I, I will leave the town. Hmm. Okay. Well. That was fortuitous. I just walk, pull up, pop over this? Probably. All right, Admiral, I've got some news and a letter, apparently. Ah, your excellency. So, what did you discover? There is indeed a spy among the Nords, but the spy's identity remains to be proven. Take this, I have recovered this note which seems to suggest that your secrets have been offered to several buyers. Mm. The Alliance citizen we met did not win the bid. I knew it. My logbook has just been stolen, and of course Alba is missing. Do we really still need proof? This book must be found at all costs before Alba sells it. Your Excellency, can we count on you once more? I would like to help you, but this island is vast. How could I possibly hope to find it? Alba is from Teleme. She probably took refuge in San Mateus. This reduces the search area a little. What do you say, Your Excellency? This is a trail that deserves to be followed. I will keep you updated, Admiral. So now, Admirals. Okay. Spy from Teleme followed. Keep investigating in San Mateus. All right. The Knot Secrets. Sins of Father Petrus. Find Captain Lisandro and Hekmet. And this is find the dispensary. All right, we've got 
We've got a lot on our plate, man. A lot on our plate. All right, let's let's go back to Hikmet and help out help out uh, our companion Petrus. 